Because one good thing about it, you ain't got to worry about watering your grass no time. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Amen. Save some money on that. Yes. Let's go be cutting it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's the first last gully washing going on, what we got. But this is the day. Jesus. 
the souls of both the righteous and the wicked went to soul, the unseen world of the departed of conscious spirit. We find now that after Solomon passed away, all of a sudden <coughs> the kingdom of Israel was divided. And the northern kingdom had ten tribes, and then you had Judah and Benjamin, the other two. Find right here, 14th chapter, verse 1. So Abijah slept with his fathers, and they buried him in the city of David. And Asa's son reigned in his state. In his days, the land was quiet for ten years. So we see right now, Asa now comes into reign, and he is the third king of Judah after the vision of the kingdom. And now that, Brother Casey, he's actually the sixth one since the time Israel demanded a king. They don't want the judges. They say, we want to have a king. So we find right now, they want to be like everybody else. All right. yeah. I want to have a king. Yeah. And we find Asa. Yeah. Like I'm saying right now, Brother, good to see you, Brother Cease. We're looking at 2 Chronicles 14, verse 11. Have confidence in God. Yeah. We find right now, and Asa did what was good in the right in the eyes of the Lord. Lord is God. We find right now all the kings back in the biblical days didn't do right. Amen. Mm -hmm. We find right now that in the history of the southern kingdom uh, is what we're looking at today because the first two kings were basically bad kings which had moments of goodness. But the next two kings, Sister Divine, were basically good kings who had moments of badness. But when Asa took the throne of Judah, after his father died, he determined to do what was good and right in the eyes of the Lord. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. We find now that when you're in position of authority, people are going to be following what you're doing. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You, even in your home, whatever you decide to do, the yeah. children are going to follow. That's right. Yeah. That's right. But you watch good or bad. You're going to tell them, don't do what I got to do as I say. No, it don't always work like that. Yeah. 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 Right. He's got their eyes on you. Well, see, that's why you got to be real careful. What do the lies see? Yeah. What do the lies hear? Yes, because you are an example of leadership. So we look at here, as we're going back in the leadership finding here of Asa. Asa did things that was right in God's eyes. One thing he did, Brother Cecil, he took away the altars of the strange gods. So we find right now that was idolatry been running rapid all along. Yes, and God told him, when you go in the Canaan land, what I give you, don't go horn out the other dog. That's it. Don't be like everybody else. Yes, sir. I am the only true living God. I done sat water at the Red Sea. I done killed the Egyptians. I need all these things for you. Yes. I just need you to trust in me. Yes. Brothers and sisters, some of us today are going through some struggles right now. Amen. Some trials and tribulations yes. right now. But I need you to have confidence in God. Yes. I don't care how hard and heavy this thing seems right now. Yes. I need you to know, even in modern times where we are today, God is still real. All right. yes. God still has the prayers. You know? I don't care how dark it seems in human history. I don't care how bad it seems every time you look on the news, how bad the story is. I'm telling you about the same God that was real back in those days. He's still real today. Same yesterday, today. He changes nothing. Somebody got told a bad news, some bad history, whatever it is. And I want you to understand this moment. I need you to have Amen. Yes, sir. Asa, he was interested here. He raised, he took the, the things he was determined to do what was right in God's eyesight. Now he reigned for 41 years. He sought to restore the ways of David. Yes. Everybody don't want to do right. Amen. Come on now. Everybody don't want to follow what the instructions is. Yes. They decide to do anything want to go along to get along. Yes. We find right here that's not what Asa did. Now we find right here verse 3. For he took away the altars of the strange God in high places and break down the images and cut down the growth. He did some tall stuff right now. You got to understand now. All of a sudden they've been praising our dog. Come on here. They've been doing all these different things. And that's one of the big things in the ten tribes of, of, of the northern kingdom. They decided to put these groves and everything up so you wouldn't go back to Jerusalem to praise God. Yeah. So they said, well, you can do the same thing right here. It's almost like imitation back up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can do anything you want. It's kind of a COVID did it. Yeah. 
you ain't got to go to church. You sit right here and everything's all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He said, well, sit out there gathering with the brethren. <laughs> he wants you to come and assemble yourself That's right. with Amen. other people that got some heartache and real life trouble yeah. to find out your story ain't all by itself. Yes. Yes. When you get in the midst of the true living God, you hear somebody else going through something worse off than you. Right. And you think you got it bad, like, that. maybe I'll put my hand yeah. on my right. <laughs> I thought I had it bad. Yeah, yeah. I'm over here, husband, brother, can you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I've seen some sin. Yes, Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord Jesus. to come around and see what God is doing yeah. on a universal scale. Yes, sir. Because God is so awesome and amazing, you need to be able to be around somebody that God and did a miraculous thing to. If he did it for them, guess what? He's good enough for you.
the kingdom was quiet before him. Yeah. You find right now in this quietness right now that what he did was he moved some stuff out of the way and because God made his enemy behave. Yes. Some of us have come out of a storm and that's a blessed quietness going on in your life right now. It's like, I don't know what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> that's a sense right now. That's a time to reinforce. And like Asa did what he did. He constructed fortified cities to protect the people from the enemy. When the enemy and when the storm of life are not coming your way, now is the time to be praying for your children. Amen. 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 Praying for the church. Yes, praying for your job. Yes. Praying for your loved one. Yes. Now the time is not to sit down and quit. It's a time to get more prayer active than anything else. Amen. That's power in the prayer life. But you need to have somebody that's going to go through a storm they don't realize it's going through. Amen. Amen. You know God made a way. You ought to have confidence in God. Yeah. If he did for you, you ought to be able to do it for somebody. That's right. You don't cause on a regular basis of death. Say, pray for me. i got a storm going on. Oh. One thing about it, it's been quiet all of a sudden when God hits you with a storm. Yeah. Uh -huh. Make yeah. you draw you close to him. Right. Yes. Make you get on your knees. Yes. Yes. Get you off your high horse. Get you on your knees. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 
a series yes. of events. Yes. That's right. Yes. That's right. A series yes. of events. That's right. You know what you mean by that? If it ain't one thing to do. Come on. Long you live here, it's something else. That's right. Always. Always. It's another Always. step. That's right. Oh, that's 
get us. Yes. Because God needs it. That nothing you got, he don't know. Amen. Right, right now, verse 10. And then Asa. Mm -hmm. Look what he did. He didn't cow down. Mm -hmm. He showed up for the fight. Right. Brother Sue, I need to tell somebody here today. Show up for the fight. Yeah. You can't get the victory yeah. until you show up for yeah. the fight. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever it is, spiritually, emotionally, psychologically, you got to fight for. God wants you to show up That's right. for the battle. That's it. He get the glory. He's going he to get the glory. Yeah. He can't get the glory if you ain't showing up. He puts you in a situation. He knows everything. There's nothing going on in your life that surprised God. Now, I just know it's surprising you. Yes. 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 But God ain't surprised. Yes. God already know he brought you to it, man. We can bring you through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you get this now. Yeah, God done brought you through whatever it is you're facing this morning. That's right. Amen. So he can get through it. Yeah. So he can get through it. That's right. And the bottom line is he got to put you in a place where you can't get credit for it. Testament, but guess what? There's two 
on the cake. Yeah. But we ought to be able to see how God responded back in the old days. Come on. Back when there was nobody else you can trust but him. Yeah. When everything was against him, and if he did it before, guess what? He can do it again. Amen. Amen. There you go. That's what you need to get this morning in your spirit. That's it. He can do it, and I want you to apply faith pressure to know that God, if you did it to him back then, Amen. I know you're going to do That's it for right. me. Right. You got to have confidence in that. I know you're going to do it for me. I'm your child. I'm trusting you. That's it. I believe in you.
things you gotta have, brothers and sisters, today mm -hmm. is absolute courage. Yes. yes. You gotta have courage and believe, make no difference what's going on, that God is gonna show up and show out and fight for you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. There's nothing that you're facing that God ain't gonna handle. That's it. Yeah. God ain't gonna put you out there to lose. Yeah. Because you represent them. That's right. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. God don't lose. Yeah. God don't never lose. Hallelujah. We gotta have courage that believe that. He got somebody behind us that's got a perfect record of never losing. Yes. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Amen. Yes. Ain't nothing we got going on. We are the one that hindered God from our blessing. Because yeah. we put down in God what we can't do. Yeah. We put handcuffs on God. We say, God, we can't wait. We can come. Can't cook because we never tried. Yes. 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 Come on now. Yes. You got to let go and let go. Come on now. Yes. If you expect a miracle, Whoa. God going to give you a miracle. Yes. If you expect it, yes. 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 if you got confidence in it, yes. Yes. he's going to blow your mind. Oh. Amen. It's going to be big. Yes. Yes. Come on now. We got a big God. Yes. Yes. You got a small problem. Yes. 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 Big you. Yes. But your God is bigger than your God. Yes. Not only do we got to have absolute confidence in God, we need to have an absolute commitment to God, and all that, but absolute courage. Mm -hmm. As Asa learned that the name of the Lord has strength. Yes, yes. yes. Right. Brothers and sisters, yes. there's power yes. in that name. Yes.
some glory. Yeah. Oh, yes. Woo. Right. Thank you. You do it. Thank you. If you win, trust me. Thank and you gotta have absolute concern for God. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You gotta have absolute concern. If we were in a similar position, we might pray God that no person prevail against us. But Asa already given the battle to the Lord. Now he was concerned about.
I'm going against whatever it is. Yes. That yes. gives you some problem. That mountain. Yes. Whatever mountain it is. Hey. Yes. I got the name of God. Yes. yes. I'm going against you tomorrow. That's right. Yes. It might be illness. Yes. It might be grief. Yes, sir. But it's in God's name. Yes. Yes. I'm going to deal with you tomorrow. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. I don't care what he said. The multitude. His multitude was a million men. Yes. Fighting yes. Ethiopian. Yes. Straight up bad actors. Yes. That's up. Bloodthirsty. Amen. Amen. He said, but it's in your name. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I got courage. Oh, yes. It's in your name. Yes. I'm going to pray up. Yes. It's in your name. Lord. Yes. If I got to go down, it's going down. Yes. Yes. I'm telling you what it is. Knuckle up, guard your grill. Because here we come. Amen. You better get ready. You uh -huh. better follow lunch. And you better not let nothing at home. Yes. And i tell you one thing. You better tell your grandma to break your plate because you ain't going home. Amen. Yes, sir. 
the verse 12 says. That's all gone. Now y'all read. Y'all read. So the, so the Lord, Lord smote the Ethiopians for a reason. And for a reason. And the Ethiopians fled. Wait a minute now. <coughs> One million. Yeah. I guess 580,000. Yeah. He was looking out one way. Yeah. But what happened verse 12? Yeah. So the Lord spoke. Stop right there. Who did it? The Lord. Who did it? The Lord. God did it. Yeah. God spoke. Yeah. I don't know how he done it. Hey. But the record declared God dusted the bars off. That's hey, right. It was a million of them, twice as many of them. Yeah. But guess what? They didn't win. That's it. Just so they got the number don't mean God's a number. Yeah. God did it. God smoked the Ethiopians. Yeah. Before Asa. Yeah. Asa sat right in and God blowing his mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This big brother sees him. Yes. I got all of my men and I ain't, ain't none of them fighting. Yeah. God doing this. Hey. I don't know what's happening out yeah. there. There's twice as many of them. Come on. But it's a battle going on. Yeah. And we sit here beside not watching. Watch. No casualties. Yeah. Ain't none of us getting scarred up. Yes. 
Yeah. In your tent. Yeah. A big blessing. Yeah. Thank you. 